And to Egypt now, where more than 250 ideas and inventions are being displayed to the public this week at the 5th Cairo International Exhibition for Innovation. Now, the event connects the government with the vibrant minds in the country in the hopes to grow domestic technology manufacturing. CGTN's Adele El Maroui tells us more. Mohamed Afifi has been an electronics technician in the private sector for 20 years. Economic turbulences Egypt went through seven years ago has laid him off. Instead of giving up, he started inventing his own dreams. This is the second year he participates in Cairo's International Exhibition of Innovation. This year, I am exhibiting smart shoes. I'm specifically targeting the elders who live alone. This boot detects all kinds of threats, like gas leaks, fire, and so on. When threats are detected, the boots make a call to an emergency contact while giving sound, light, and vibration alerts to the user in case he or she is still conscious. To save money, Avifi visits the flea market every week to hunt for electronic components for cheaper prices. He hopes his invention could win in the exhibition's competition. I think it's very useful to be here. I get a lot of feedback on my devices. That helps me in developing my product. I get great exposure by seeing what others are working on. And maybe I can find an investor who can help me move to product refining and mass production. The Egyptian government has been investing a lot lately to support startups. Government incubators and venture capitals have been hunting for talents that could put Egypt on the global technological map. It's why this event is open to all ideas, from weapons and defense solutions, ideas to be patents, to manufacturing existing products locally. The b basic foundation in building the new education system is to produce a new generation that's capable of innovating, capable of lifelong learning, uh, equipped with the right skills. And uh, having an event like this is an eye-opener for youngsters, how to uh, grow up to be innovators. So all, all together, all of us in the government are working towards equipping our most important resource, the human capital, with the right skills towards the goal, an innovation-driven uh, economy. The exhibition also holds seminars and lectures to tackle the challenges Egypt is facing to boom the technological sector. Cairo's International Exhibition of Innovation offers financial prizes of up to 11,000 US dollars for the outstanding inventions. It also gives a unique opportunity for one project to find its way to mass production. Most of these aren't necessarily new inventions. Rather, they offer solutions to growing the domestic manufacturing industry. Adel Mahoui, CGTN, Cairo.